Well, uh, I haven't made a video for a couple weeks, and I just want to give you an update that since deer season is almost over, I got till the 20th here in Iowa, and I still have a late muzzleloader tag, but the deer are starting to shed their antlers already, so don't know if I'll go for a buck there. But I still got a doe tag for bow, and I might try and get out this weekend and then the following, because with school being till 2:45, I have no time after school to go hunt. But and speaking of the deer shedding their antlers already. About a week ago, went up behind my new Cuddyback trail cam I got for Christmas and found this two feet behind it on the trail. I never did get a picture of the buck though, but I couldn't believe it. It was uh, about six at night after after we got done hunting and walked back and drove to check the trail cam and we had the light shining from the uh, trail to the trail cam and I looked over and saw it and couldn't believe it, but. Uh, we got a new area, about 425 acres to hunt, and just me and my grandpa are allowed to hunt out there. And we've been hunting there just since just before the rut, and uh, we haven't, we really didn't get a scout or anything, so we didn't know what kind of bucks were there. And we've seen a couple of good ones that got them on trail cam, but I didn't know we had this big tall eight point on there, and I just can't wait to see what this deer is next year because he's not that massive. But I hope to find the other shed because. I looked within a hundred yard radius of the where I found this one and never found it, but I'll be out to look again and try and find it in some other sheds, so we'll see how that goes. There you go. Scored 69 and 2.8. Well, I can believe it too, it's got 11 and a half G2s and 22 inch main B. So, I hope to find the other shed. I'll probably go back out and look and try and find some more sheds. We'll see how it goes.